Apologies, friends. I'm sorry. Hi there. My name is Ilya, or as some like to call me, the Duke of Donuts. Now, my friends, my donuts and donuts, I'd like to invite you to come with me on a trip, a journey across the country, no, the world, to find out about what is the donut. Where does it come from? What kind of varieties are there? And what exactly drives people to make them and sell them? Oh, <laughs> don't you know what time it is? It's time for another donut adventure with the Duke of Donuts. Hey, my donuts and donuts. The Duke of Donuts here, and I am in the city of Inglewood at 805 West Manchester Boulevard. And today, I am taking you on a historic and iconic journey, Randy's Donuts. Oh my God, you can't wait. I'm so excited. All right, I'm gonna be introducing you to Mark, who is the current owner and proprietor, who's gonna talk a little bit about the history, as well as the ongoings in the back of what kind of cool magical treats they're crafting out for the hungry Angelinas. Now, let's go check out Randy's Donuts. How's it going? Good man, how are you? Good, good. It's been a long time since the Donut Festival. I'm so glad to see you and so glad to finally be here. No, glad you could, glad you found time to come by. What can you tell the donuts and donuts out there of what Randy Donuts is about? Well, you know, a lot of people know we've been around since the 1950s. Um, you know, the two brothers bought it from their uncle in the uh, early 70s. I took over the business in 2015. I have passion for food and food enterprises. It's been a real good transition. Um, I've made a, a very just concerned point of not changing anything. I've got the same bakers here wow. that have been working here, some for 15 years. Mm -hmm. we, have, we use the same ingredients that Larry and Ron have used for the last 40 years. We can do 8,000 donuts a day. 8,000 donuts. Yeah. I mean, we are cooking from 9 at night till 2 in the afternoon. So what's the next step? Where are you all going to be going now? We're expanding. Okay. We've look, been looking for locations for about 12 months. Okay. It's very competitive out there trying to find drive through in other locations. We're opening up in Century City okay. this summer at the Westfield uh, Century City Shopping Center. Awesome. We're introducing a mobile mobile app system. Oh wow. In probably about three to four weeks, they're gonna be able to place their orders online or through the mobile app, through our website, and for pickup or delivery in local areas. And, and we're just, you know, we're trying to get that word out. We're talking more about the iconic brand. It's been a huge filming location, hasn't it? We get requests all the time. We had Snoop Dogg here a couple of what? months back. Uh, John Legend was here filming something. So we get stuff all the time, and, and we're always trying to accommodate, because it's, you know, it's good for us, it's good for them, it's good for Los Angeles. Have you always had like a passion of working around donuts specifically? I know with food, there's such a wide variety of what you go into. Why donuts especially? Why, why, why go into such a, such a business like this? Donuts have just always been a part you know, of that fabric of a good quality, low price item. For me personally, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. my family, we used to travel to, to Lake Tahoe every year when okay. we were kids. Okay. You know, we'd all climb into the back of a crappy old station wagon. <laughs> and at the end of the summer, or at the end of our two week period, we'd always have a huge picnic, 10, 12 families. Uh -huh. And the oddest thing, all the, the grandpas and grandmas would come to the picnic and they would bring boxes of donuts. Okay. And I just thought, that is the strangest thing. And then when you eat them, you're like, you know what? Donuts are a great dessert. <laughs> donuts can be great for any occasion. That's what I love about them. You know, for de breakfast, dinner, lunch, sure. or even midnight, you know? Um, as far as donuts, would you be able to show us inside a little bit? And talk Absolutely, about come, on come on in. Come on in. Awesome. Generally starts over here. We don't have a mix going right now, unfortunately. But we'll mix up a, a batter of dough. It'll come over here to the, to the baking table. We use a particular kind of wood. The maple wood just absorbs everything better. The donut then goes into this oven called a proofer. It, it rises like bread rises in, a, in an oven. Right. Same kind of concept. We'll come over here and we'll fry. We do everything out of a single fryer under a single hood. The donuts will come out of there He'll come over here, he'll put the glaze on it. Everything is glazed, everything is done by hand. Wow. It's very, very labor intensive. It, it it's the most like costly it. way to make donuts, but it works for us. It'll then cross over behind you. And where, where the lady is decorating, Lucy's decorating everything by hand. That's dipping every individual donut one by one 
into the chocolate or the maple or whatever whatever particular uh, icing she's using at the time. It's all about the employee. Most of them have been here for, for quite a long time. In particular, my bakers, a lot of my sales staff, my manager who's hiding over there, Maria, right now. Hey, Maria. <laughs> a um, lot of family here working together. So out of all the billions and thousands and trillions of donuts that you make here, what is your favorite donut? You know, I keep it simple. I'm still a glazed guy. We'll sell 25 to 30,000 glazed a month. Jeez. But you know, everybody's got their favorites. No, for sure. You know, my wife goes nuts for buttermilk. Oh. I, you know, I've got my next door neighbor, and he doesn't have an apple, if I don't bring him an apple fritter every day, and that's the, you know, that's the crazy thing about this business. Yeah. Every weekend, I come down, you know, I'm always down here, I'm down here every weekend, and I come back to my neighborhood, and if I don't have boxes, like right now my truck's full of boxes <laughs> for all the neighbors. Wow. If I don't bring them all their donuts, I get angry neighbors. So you're like uh, the Mr. Rogers of donuts. You just show up and everyone's like, hey, here comes right kind of. <laughs> They see my truck in the afternoon and they know there's donuts in there. Hey, I really thank you for your time. Oh, no, pleasure. Glad you came down and, and make sure you do not leave here without all your favorite treats. Oh, uh, I definitely will. I'll won't. make sure you guys get hooked up. Well, folks, there you have it. Randy's Donuts at 805 West Manchester Boulevard in the city of Inglewood. I had a fabulous time. Now, if you excuse me, I'm gonna go stuff my face with these donuts. Have a good one. All right, my donuts and donuts. Here comes judgment time. Today, I'll be trying the iconic, famous Randy's Donuts glazed donuts per the recommendation of Mark. Hot damn. Sorry, hold on. Mm. It's like being in a jungle forest full of sweet, delicious, colorful berries. And while they're dancing around you, you're in a sleeping bag made of love and vanilla. And you just want to leave the forest, but you can't because it's just so comfortable. And you're comforted by that warm embrace of that sleeping bag made of vanilla and love. And the fairies just continue to dance and shout. And then you wake up and you realize, that was a dream, that's a reality. Oh, definitely Duke approved. Uh, all right, donuts to be ready for later. Oh, I'm sorry, I totally forgot about the list. All right, so why is this place Duke approved? I'll give you three reasons why. First, iconic location. This place has been here since 1953 and has been a beloved location by many Angelinas. Number two, 24 hour availability and a drive through. You don't have to wait in line inside the shop, you can wait in your car and grab some donuts. How awesome is that? And number three, I would say the most important one myself, but passionate staff. As you can see, the owner, the people working there, the bakers, they love what they do. They do it on a regular basis and they've been doing it for years. That's why the donuts are so good. The ingredients are great and the people that make it are wonderful themselves. So, this place, Duke approved.